Hi, I'm Rhonda Anderson with the American Diabetes Association. We are here at the 6th Disparities Partnership Forum in Crystal City, Virginia. I'm so excited to be welcoming <laughs> J. Anthony Brown. He is going to be honored this evening with the Community Spirit Awards. Thank you so much for well, spending no, some time with Thank you, with thank you, thank you for the Diabetes Association for honoring me. I've been involved with diabetes programs for quite some time. Uh, I actually found out about the Diabetes Association by going to a diabetes another function, a, a really big one, and I did not know that they had diabetes summer camps for kids, mm -hmm. and that's how I got involved. And I started a foundation and sent some kids to summer camp, and so, and I also worked on a television show. I was telling somebody earlier that there's a, a television show that started that was called The Life, mm -hmm. and I had an opportunity to work on that when it started. It's on the internet now, so, you know, and then being the the son of uh, two parents that had diabetes, so and a grandmother that had diabetes, and aunts and uncles. So I've always, it's always been, in, you know, in my life, and you know, this is an opportunity to, to help and bring awareness to it. Well, when, when I've spoken to you in the past, you have mentioned the um, impact that diabetes has had on your life personally. Mm -hmm. Can you tell us a little bit about? Well, my father was a, a typical diabetic, and this was before I even know I had diabetes. Uh, you know, it's not funny, but it's just the, his reaction toward the disease. He had he had, had uh, both his legs amputated. So I go to see my dad in the hospital. He would already had two legs amputated. And I opened the hospital drawer, and I don't know how it happened, but it was full of honey buns, full. Now, his attitude was, when you hear it, it doesn't make sense, but when you see that a man who has both legs amputated, he said to me, well, I already got two legs amputated. A honey bun is not going to hurt me. And it, it did hurt him because of the, it was the honey buns that he had before. But that's just the attitude of most diabetics. Sometimes they have this attitude where I will give up a leg or I will give up a toe or I will lose my eyesight for some, and eat something that I know that's not good for me. And I mean, I'm guilty of it too. I eat things that I know I shouldn't. And bringing awareness of it kind of brings, puts you back on track. That's what's so important about having a program like this really appreciate you being here. You do have a tremendous platform. <laughs> you keep it. saying I that. I do, because you do. And we appreciate you being here. Um, and congratulations again for your award. Thank you evening. so much. Uh, so we'll be bringing you more information from the Six Disparities Partnership Forum in Crystal City, Virginia. Thank you very much. Thank you.